go. Hey guys, now that we have the C80 unpacked, let's go ahead and set it up. In this video, I'm going to show you what to do and not do in order to save you a headache. Make sure to subscribe to the channel and thanks for your support. Uh, so we'll start off with the very first thing, which is basically installing the app. Let's see here. After a little teetering, I was able to scan uh, the barcode to get to the app. So let's go ahead. I'm going to do iPhone app. So I'm going to say get. Okay, so now we have the app installed. I'm going to go ahead and open. Hopefully you can see. I'm going to put notifications on. And we agree to the terms. And we get this video. So don't already have an account, uh, which I thought I did because I have other uh, Segway uh, devices. Um, but I'm just going to go ahead and register. Profile here, log in, up to, and let's see, it just kind of asks you your precise location. I'll say, well, once I'm using the app, and it's okay for Bluetooth, and uh, Bluetooth would like to use, okay, I don't have Bluetooth on, apparently. Let's see what's going on here. Back to the app, and okay, so we're at the point of searching, I'm hit search, Oh, I guess I can't find it because. So it looks like 03, which is page three to power on, is a matter of just tapping with your NFC card of uh, the display and it should turn on uh, and making sure, make sure your, your phone is, uh, is set to Bluetooth, uh, which will enable the airlock on the app. So we don't have any power. So what I'm going to do is basically take the key here and I'm going to insert it into the back lock, which should, by doing so, uh, should unlock uh, the seat, which it did. And what we'll do is we have our battery here and looks like they have the prong and we should be able to just simply just go ahead and connect this. Okay, all right, I think we're connected. This is the, the front, I guess if I click here, I clicked it once, it looks like um, from what I see, maybe the battery is not completely charged per se. So let's see what we can accomplish. NFC card, let's see. Okay, perfect. So now I can turn it on. So I should be able to uh, turn on the app. If you can see, based on what I saw on the battery, that the, the battery is not fully charged when you get it. And when you do turn it on, that the front headlights and these little indicator, light indicators, I'll call them right now, will turn on as well. Okay, so now that the Mopad is turned on and I was able to search again and I found my moped segue my moped so let's go ahead and connect i have very little battery but hopefully we can pair uh it says hold down the brake for three seconds looks like they may be pressing the button um uh, but doesn't say to do that but i'm gonna try to do that let's see okay it did activate and it also seems as if it may have unlocked, uh, yeah, and popped off the seat. Now, I will say that the seat itself, be very careful with it, because I did notice that it is a little, I'm not going to say flimsy, but I uh, may have to tighten the joint somewhere in here, because it's not as loose as it is. But I'm going to put it right back down here. And I noticed that my device is activated. So let's go past here. And when I click next, it did make a chime. And it gives you a set of instructions. Let's see. It's sort of like a little tutorial of what to do. So for right now, I'm going to go skip by all of that and skip. Congratulations. You've been identified as an owner now. Okay, awesome. So I have 38% battery left. I have not ridden it at all. So 
uh, sees like a 26 kilometers range and uh, the odometer is zero. Got the key. If you're new to the channel, make sure to subscribe, hit the thumbs up, and ring that notification bell to be informed about new content. Thank you again so much for the support and be safe out there.